Good evening. We hope that you've enjoyed this year's Relay for Life event as much as we have, but do not fear, it is not done yet. We will be finishing at 10 p.m. tonight. But for now, let's reflect on how much we've accomplished since 10 a.m. this morning and think about what more we can do after we end at 10 p.m. tonight. We all have our own reasons for attending this event. We may have fought cancer ourselves or watched someone we love battle the disease. We may have driven a neighbor to their cancer treatments, or we may have held a family member's hands after they learned of their diagnosis. We might have spent hours awaiting results from a recent scan, or we may have called a friend to comfort them after having lost a loved one to cancer. So we relay. Ultimately, we relay so that we can celebrate all who have battled cancer, remember loved ones lost, and fight back against this terrible disease. In both celebrating the lives of those we love and remembering those we've lost, we are motivated to do something, anything, to make sure no one else we care about or no one else we know has to face this terrible disease. We have witnessed too much pain. We have seen too much suffering. We have lost too many people we love. We must fight back. We must fight back to protect our children, brothers, sisters, parents, aunts, uncles, grandparents, and friends from this disease. Your participation in the Relay for Life means you are a vital part of American Cancer Society's efforts to eliminate cancer. Together, we are taking this day and this night to take a stand against cancer and to commit to creating hope for a cancer-free world. Tonight, we need all of you to commit to saving more lives from this terrible disease. Whether it is yourself, a family member, a friend, a coworker, or someone you don't even know yet. Whether you convince your mother or aunt to get a mammogram, Help a friend quit smoking. Send an email to or call your legislator to pass legislation or tell your neighbor to call the American Cancer Society to get more information on their cancer diagnosis. Such simple steps can and do save lives. To stay silent during this time is to let cancer win. In honor, in memory, and in support of all of those who have faced this disease, we will fight back.